Now this definitely has to be one of the strangest cars I've ever seen. You pretty much stand while it drives and if you want to turn, you push your body sideways. Cool concept, pretty stupid though. <laughs> I found this car, it's an electric car that you can drive, right? But that's not the main feature. It's a car that you can drive onto the spot here and a drone connects to the top of your car and you fly away. Yo, okay. If this was the actual thing, I'd probably use it. And it can even pick you up too. No. This is the future right here. That is dope. What? Or if your kids come from a rich family, you can buy a Bugatti? So you guys know Bugatti is like the most expensive car in the world. And I've made one. Dude, that actually looks super dope. Like it legit looks like the real. He got the butterfly doors and everything. He picking his girlfriend up. Oh, he's flexing on like everybody watching this video right now. Holy cow. Okay, he has the world's tallest motorbike. Don't know why. You would need a motorbike this big. Look how big it is. Bro! <laughs> that's not a motorbike, that's a monster bike. And that's a normal motorbike. Can, I can actually go underneath it. Do you love pool? Well, don't worry, we got you covered on the Yoad channel. This is a car with a freaking pool table on the back. Like, look at that. It's a legit working pool table and everything. These people are actually playing pool on it. It'd be like the, the legend at a party if you took this thing to a party. His name is Fleshby and he is pretty much a ginormous airbag. So if a person hits it, it won't hurt them, like they'll just bounce off the side of it. Oh, it can also like, like turn into that type of car too. Okay, now I actually can't do like this idea. Now, if you're into buses, I introduce you to the free leveled bus. This is the longest bus in the whole entire world. I don't even know physically how this works, but it does. Don't ask, okay? Someone made this right here and it's pretty much a ball that spins and they got inspired by Star Wars to make this. Is there any amazing use to it? No, you can just go upside down, okay? Look at this. How much fun is that? Or another like small kid's car I found was this car. Look how cool it looks. But I, I think adults actually drive this. Dude, that actually looks so cool. <laughs> oh, and he has to like get down like this. <laughs> oh, no way. That's right, guys. This guy is standing underneath the world's biggest truck. <laughs> Holy cows, that's a big truck. That's a normal truck, and that's like a smaller truck. And living, whoever made this is living life right now. It's 64 times bigger. Then the original made car, it's got bathrooms, kitchens, beds? Is this a car or a hotel? Holy moly. It actually drives too. <laughs> How? Or you can put an actual pool in the back of your car driving around. You know what? If it was a hot day, I could see how this would be an amazing thing. Now, obviously we had to throw this car in. It's a car that if you put water over top of it, the car changes color. So as you can see, the car was blue, but now it has the whole car. It's so cool. Would you guys have a car like this? Where it can change colors. I don't know, like low key, it is pretty dope. Or how about the world's smallest motorbike? <laughs> what? It's like this tiny. How do you even stay on it? <laughs> oh, it's great. I found this huge self driving car that's meant to be a taxi. There's actually no steering wheel inside of it. That I thought was really interesting. You just tell it where to go with your voice and it will go there. Look at this. I mean, that does look pretty sick. The design of it looks dope too. And look how much space there is in that thing. A floating cars of the future. I don't want it. I don't want a car that looks like that. Looks like a freaking bubble. Tell me guys if you in the comments would actually drive that. I mean, the more I look at it, it does seem low key pretty cool. If it moves that fast and floats, I could be with it. Hey, is your kid in the need for a car? Well, look no further, because Toyota have literally made this car for kids so they can drive around. I don't know why a kid would even need a car. I don't even have a car, and this kid has a car they can drive around in. It looks so tiny and weird. But yeah, your kid can actually buy this car and drive around anywhere they want to. Oh, I even found the world's longest limo right here. Look at this. Is that a pool in the back of there too? And it can even have a helicopter on the back? Damn, yo. Salute to America for having the world's longest limousine. You could probably fit like a hundred people in there. I also found this car. I actually think this is pretty stupid. It's this huge car that has a TV on the side of it. Why? Because it's stupid. <laughs> I don't know if I would ever drive this car. This looks like a waste of screens, okay? So this right here, guys, is the biggest helicopter in the world. So big that its job is actually to pick up other helicopters and planes and deliver them to places. But look at this man. He big. He picking up a whole airplane. <laughs> yeah, I've, never, I've literally never seen a helicopter pick up an airplane. And he's off. That's the funniest thing ever. <laughs> helicopter picking up another helicopter. <laughs> what is, what's the point of having this? It's like a rocket at the back of a car. 
<laughs> Full wheelers? Damn, my man pimping. They see me roll. And what the heck? Is he trying to protect himself from like a zombie apocalypse? Oh, I look like Tower of Dumber and Dumber. All made out of fur, but I feel like it got wet. It'd be so like unnecessary. It's a. I don't even know what the heck this trisocity is. This guy has a mini crane on it. That could come in handy. What are you trying to do? That's actually crazy. A hammer with like snow singers on the bottom. That's trash. Get that out of here, okay? This looks like a wooden coffin car. You know what? If you're into that type of stuff, go. A dinosaur car? No way. A Mickey Mouse car. Ew. That's scary, y'all. Don't be bring that around here. Don't show me that. A bubble freaking freewheeler. Now, that's what I'm talking about. That's the future right there. I don't want to know, my man, like, <laughs> cardboard box car. Yeah, that's pretty sick. I actually thought this was pretty dope. And it's not a car, it's a boat. But look at it. It's this ginormous hovercraft. See how you have tiny hovercrafts? This is the biggest hovercraft boat. It's so cool. Like, it can go on water. It can go on land. This is actually a new car that Aston Martin want to make. They've got these awesome suicide opening doors. And you go inside. It's like a full living room in there. And the coolest feature about it, the key... Right there, it's actually floating and spinning. Don't ask me why, because I wouldn't, I can't tell you, but it's futuristic is what it's meant to be. 